Okay, let's get this show on the road. So, what happened was, uh, look at that. Got a fight. Fight that's a warning here and there. Well, I see the warning splashing. This is freaking. He's going, he's going to look. Queen, pull up, saying what's going on. Warren told him this, da da da. That's what he said, I look for escaping. Everybody's trying to go to the door, they didn't catch him. Um, after that, go to the spring, talk about the formation, about the shogun, all that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, talk about heel mostly. That is a beast, OG. Um, Queen's thinking about what he should do with Luffy heel. He goes out here with the keys, stuff like that. Oh, he met with his old friend. The guy in the cage. I don't know what he looked like. Um, next chapter, right? Da 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 da. Got spotted. Queen's playing rules. I have a sumo match, quote unquote. First two actually uh, step out of the ring, get killed, and have to call it on the neck. No problem for Luffy here. So when a couple of random guys come in first, then there'll be Luffy, uh, Luffy knock him out, boom, boom, boom. Next, uh, I'll say Drake and all them. Get the springs. Pull up on Nami and them. Nami's off of the towel. Ooh, um, everybody got impressed, knocked out. Lustful, lustful intentions. Intentions. Um, Drake couldn't handle that. Not to Sanji and Hawkins and Drake saw what Sanji was wearing, you know, stuff man, whatever. Stuff black, yeah, stuff man. It, Sanji did along with Nami, Robin, and Shinobu. Then Sanji actually dropped the beam saying, oh, Law Crew got captured by Sasuke first, um, Kaido's crew. Uh, Law Crew, um, Law, Law, Crew for the worst, right? But when we think about the chapter, which is 9. 36th was Zorba versus this new guy, Bungie or whatever. I mean, so what about the Solemn Shinsui? So, so, I'll take it back. Now, things get crazy next chapter when actually Zorba starts to fight the dude. Whatever. And then, this man said, guys, came out of nowhere. Said, Zorba was a fan of the Shinsui. Yeah, Zorba was a fan of the Shinsui. Zorba was a fan of the Shinsui. And some chick come and see or whatever. And the girl engaged in a two on one. On the quest of get him getting food and drinks. If, the, if he's a stage girl, so yeah, he did that. So was a good guy. That's him. So, let him do his thing. He did his thing. He got actually injured by the man slayer, but he toughed him through it. And he messed up the man slayer. All because the guy was interfering. I can still call it two on one, so whatever. Luffy got talking about mention of a new power, whatever, yada yada yada. That's it. So yeah. Next, uh, law getting tight. For all the stuff going on. And Law just can't stand the fact that his crew is captured. All this stuff going disarray. People don't want to do this. People don't want to do that. I'm like, oh, do something. <laughs> After fight with the man slave dude, Zora knocked out. And girl and Moko took Zora out of there and went to some place. And Zora waking up. Zora talks to Zora. Zora asks for Zora his strength. He says, you know, Zora's my guy. Zora's our dude. And the chapter shows that, oh man, it's, um, that's my... That's Hiyori, yeah. Uh, one of the sister, Hiyori. Fine. She's fine, she's fine, you know, she's fine, she's perfect. Um, yeah, the full one through all the reviews of the past couple of chapters I didn't go through, so yeah. Pick up your will. Peace.